welcome to day 23 of the web show and this one's coming to you from a freezing cold New York City which is just ironic after leaving uh, LA in t-shirt weather and arriving in New York and it was just pretty much below freezing and uh, to get to Grand Central Station a new adventure about to begin and I actually got off the uh, subway about 20 blocks further than I was supposed to so a bit of a walk on my hands because I was on my way to meet a girl called Sheeta which is a pretty funny story. We actually met at a party in LA really randomly in September last year, I think it was, and we kind of stayed in touch through MySpace and stuff. And uh, when I told her about coming to New York, she said, yeah, you can stay at my house. And I was like, hell yeah. So as you can see, she's absolutely gorgeous. So um, it was fun to just get there, arrive in New York, meet up with Sheeta, and then we jumped in a cab. And that's pretty much where this adventure begins. So how are you? Hello. Oh, I'm glad to start because I'm not wearing any makeup. <laughs> <laughs> I look horrible. I can't sleep. I think I've got the flu, everybody has the flu. So where do we just meet at, like 66th and what? 66th and Columbus. And what were you doing in acting class? I was taking my second acting class. How was it? Great. Yeah. My scene partner is 17 and he's so cute and he's so shy. <laughs> he said to the acting coach, he's like, I don't think I can do this because he had to grab my waist. Wow. And like pull me towards him. And he was just so nervous about it. And I was like, just pretend I'm some girl you like. I don't think that kid's going to make it as an actor then if he can't do that. I'm like, doing. I'm not even an actor. I picked the scene in this play that he didn't even have to really get physical with me because it's a very sexual play. Wow. The Blue Room. Wow. And uh, yeah, I mean, all he had to do was grab me and like push me down on the couch. He was having trouble, but I helped him through it. Check this out. We're right in the Ooh. middle of everything. Oh, listen to those honks. Yep. Oh, why did we come through Times Square? Welcome not back a good to idea. Mia. I have to get better at telling the taxi drivers which way I want to go because I never seem to know. Because, you know, they could go east and then go down. All but right. we just went south and now we're going east. Alright. It's all part of the adventure. Adventures are our middle name. Yeah, so it was an adventure from the get go and uh, we were on a train out to a place called Yonkers, which is past the Bronx and uh, pretty crazy and a good night's sleep before waking up and this is what happened the very next morning in New York. So we're about to brave the cold? Yes, it's going to be very cold outside. <laughs> You're not in Australia anymore, Toto. No. No? No. Uh, okay, I hope you've got your warm socks on. Well. Cold. My feet might be a bit cold, but I feel pretty warm. I think you'll be okay. Yeah. And you have gloves. Wow, you're so prepared. Yeah, I'm ready to go, babe. <laughs> We're too. rocking. Whoa. Oh gosh! Shit, did I just see snow? Is it? Yes! It's oh my snowing. god, it's snowing. Yay. God, my mailbox fell down. I gotta pick that back up. Alright, we'll fix that. I'm pretty nifty with a screwdriver. I wanna see the snow. Yeah, and I didn't have to wait long for that. It started to uh, sprinkle down, and when we got in the city, it was just crazy. But it was freezing, but the adventure had started. We should have some wine at lunch. Ooh, we should, all right. Good. Yeah, adventure. So, this house I've been coming to since I was alive. Yeah. My grandparents used to live here, and now my uncle lives here. He's a firefighter. Yep. With his wife and three kids, and I rent the apartment downstairs for, like, nothing. So I can save money and buy a house. Nice. Yeah. Jeez Louise, it's cold. Yeah, it's that cold. Oh. Where are we? We're in Yonkers. We're in Yonkers, yeah. Burbs. Burbs. It's paradise. All right. Not you, really. You told me not to walk around here at night, right? Definitely not. Okay. <laughs> I don't even walk around here. Actually, I run home at nighttime sometimes. Right. If I don't go to the ATM, which is why I just open up a checking account right there. Right. Because I would always forget to get money, and I'm like, I'm not paying an ATM fee. Two dollars. Two dollars. Do you go to that church? Huh? Do you go to that church? No, that church closed down. It oh. used to be open when I was a little girl. I remember people would be out here. But um, I do want to find a church. How cool would it be if that was my that church? That would be pretty cool. It's handy. It's so it's like close. Right there. Right there. This is nothing. Imagine right. walking through this in yeah. this much snow. I used to have to walk home in like two feet of snow because I didn't know that there were buses to take me home because <laughs> I just moved here. Right. So I'd like run home at like 10 p.m. in all the snow. And I was the only person walking in the street. A little people scary. Think, people think you're crazy. I am pretty crazy, I know. but in a good way. Yeah, definitely in a good way. And the adventure started. We took the train from Yonkers into the city. It takes about 25 minutes and you go through the Bronx. And these are shots of Harlem here as we go by from the train. 
the different streets and stuff. And it's always just a buzz knowing you're heading into the city because there's just people everywhere as usual. And I hope everybody gets to come to New York. But this is Grand Central, the main uh, station. All the trains connect there. So this place is just a hive of activity all the time. It's just madness. But uh, awesome to see and awesome to be a part of it for the day. And then uh, also the entertainment you see in the subways is just incredible. Check out this band, man. I stopped. These were the first guys we saw play there. <laughs> kinds of things going on but we had to get the subway. This is a Brooklyn Bridge bound 6th train. The next stop is 33rd Street. Yeah, so I hope that uh, riding the New York subways is on everyone's to-do list. It's just amazing. But for us now, we had to hit the streets and time to film a little chat. All right, Sheena, here we are, New York. It's snowing. Yes. Just had a nice little lunch. Oh, it was so good. Late lunch. Late lunch. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't get up pretty early. Where are we going now? Now we're going to go pick up some pictures of mine yeah. from um, this photographer who shot me last week. Okay, cool. Yes, building my book. Building your book up. You got it. All right. And how often do you come to the city? Um, I come in every day. Yep. yep. Uh, Monday through Friday for castings. And um, on the weekends, if my friends have brunch or something, you know. But I don't really do the club thing anymore. Right. Those days are over. They're <laughs> long, long gone. gone. Long gone. But loungers are fun. There's actually a really cool lounge over here. It's called Gold Bar. Yeah. It's fun. Right. It's small, you know. Yep. And it's all like a lot of people I know. We're getting covered in snow. Yeah, we are. Jeez, at least. 